Ahoy fellow builders and welcome to Tune R and today we'll try this GH PNS135 by God Hunt. <laughs> Before we start, this video was brought to you by Hobby Ollie. If you are interested with God Hunt tools, you can visit their website, Facebook, Shopee, and of course their God Hunt Lazada official store. As you all know, God Hunt is a Japanese company that produces specialized hobby tools for model making, particularly for the anime and manga industry. They are known for producing high quality cutting and sculpting tools such as the Ultimate Nipper series, sanding tools, pliers, and other specialized equipment. Their tools are popular among hobbyists and professionals in various hobbies and they have a strong reputation for precision and durability. Well, as we all know the GHSPN120 or the God Hunt Ultimate Nipper is their main signature tool designed for flash cuts without leaving any marks on the workpiece. And they do have uh, several versions with slight variations in design or functionality and features sharp blades and a comfortable grip. But for today, we're going to talk about this new specialized hobby tool called the GH PNS 135 by God Hunt. And this is PNS series means pliers, nipper series. Uh, this is an entry level model that is perfect for hobbyists and beginners. The plier likes design provides strong grip and allows for easy cutting. I'm seeing this as a hybrid nipper because this is a single edge blade and has a cutting range of 3 millimeters of thickness. And this tool was recently released last January 2023 and here's the uh, packaging of uh, this tool so again uh, it's a uh, cardboard cover in its uh, black print and of course the uh, instructions at the back of this cardboard going back to this nipper uh, according to their feature the blade is thicker than the ultimate nipper and blade one nipper and has a durability of course uh, they say the, this is a stainless steel non-oxidation full quenching to avoid rust and this is a single edge okay you're going to look at this part this is the single edge with a grip of elastomer grip and the length of 140 millimeter for the design it seems that it has uh, the same grip with the other entry grade nippers um, like this one but the blades were somewhat entry grade to mid range level I think so let's check with this cutting performance so let's try with this uh, black screw so that we can see how uh, visible the white numb it is Okay, there you go fellow builders, cuts like a butter, but of course, we all know that uh, this nipper is new one. For the nub mark test, okay, let's cut it from the runner first, the, the usual practice, and then let's make a follow to cut to the smallest part of this one and there you go still I'm seeing a bit of numb marks but I think uh, it's uh, manageable okay this one is very thick so let's see And there you go. Ok, 
Okay, um, honestly, uh, we're still seeing some uh, presence of the nub marks right here. Of course, here. And as well as with this part. Okay. But if I'm going to fill it, the surface, it seems that the surface is smooth and clean. There you go. Now let's test with the uh, clear runners. We have these dark blue runners. We're going to cut this one. And we have a decent cut here. So, uh, we're still seeing uh, the uh, stress marks. It's given with this uh, material. It's a clear, uh, brittle plastic, of course. There's no special techniques here in uh, using this tool. Uh, just do the, uh, the usual thing in cutting the spruce or runner. But right now, uh, the performance was great and good. If you need a wide opening of the blade, you can do that with this snipper as well. All you have to do is to press this plastic button here and you will see the spring of this snipper will adjust and you can now spread the arms of this snipper as wide as you want. First off, um, please take note that this snipper is only compatible with plastics such as um, PS resin, PP, ABS resin, and PE resin only. It cannot cut metal but it does support clear runners. Additionally, it has a cutting capability of up to 3 millimeters for compatible materials. And when working with this snipper, um, safety is the top priority, of course. Always wear safety glasses and ensure that there are no people or fragile objects around that may be affected by the plying cut object, even though it reduces the chance of small parts flying out. It is also important to avoid touching and cutting edge directly and not applying too much pressure beyond your ability especially on the tip even it has a feature of being rust resistant still you need to prevent this from rusting be sure to wipe off dirt and fingerprints and apply oil to the shaft and cutting edge before storing lastly um please keep the sniper out of reach of the small children of course and consider providing a storage case for its protection when not in use. Indeed, this is a great tool but still it's important to handle it with care and follow these precautions for a safety and effective experience. The GHPNS135 is a single edge nipper with a thicker blade making it more durable than the ultimate nipper and blade 1 nipper. It's perfect for beginners who are new to single edge nippers and with a structure that is easy to handle and cuts smoothly. And there you go fellow builders, this is the GHPNS135, which is a single edge nipper which is more thicker blade and make it more durable than the ultimate nipper which is the SPN120 and uh, the blade 1 nipper, okay, so very perfect for beginners who are new to single edge snippers and this has a structure that easy to handle and cut smoothly and of course reducing the chance of small parts flying out of course uh, this was made with a uh, rust resistant stainless steels and it can cut plastic materials with three millimeter or less overall the ghpns 135 is a great addition to any hobbyist toolkit providing strength and ease of use to elevate hobby skills. And it seems that I'm seeing here a new episode of Nipper Wars, fellow builders. I'm hearing these rumors that there will be new Nippers contenders upcoming any moment. Again, if you're interested with uh, these tools, you can check Hobby Ali's website, Facebook, or 
their God Hand Lazada official store. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please do burst like, share as well, subscribe to my channel, and blast that notification bell for more videos. And this is GH PNS 135 Nipper from God Hand. Until next time here in Chun R, just build more and build up. Thank you.